I'm also filming It's My Yard yet. Now, I haven't watched the pay-per-view entirety yet. I've really only watched the uh, pre-show. That was the terminology I was looking for. Pre-show. Uh, although I've read some of the results for the pay-per-view, and it sounds to be like a really good show. And it really did kick off in brilliant fa fashion, especially with this WLC match, which granted is a gimmick match with um, two um, dwarf wrestlers with Hornswoggle and El Torito. But they actually put on a good show. It's um, 3MB and Los Matadores helped out Primo and Epico brilliantly with some brilliant spots that you would expect on a proper pay-per-view match. The pre-show match, you know, is just a warmer, you know, gets the crowd riled up. But they used everything in this match. It's tiny tables, tiny announce table, tiny ladders, a slightly bigger ladder, big ladder, proper tables, proper ladders. It was mental the spots they've put on. So credit to all six men on this. Or, f or four, five men if you count the half size of both wrestlers. No, no, no. Okay, Enough of short jokes. Joey Lawler did enough of that. Uh, <laughs> the commentating team having a mini Michael Cole, uh, Jerry Lowell and Jay Blair, as well as the normal commentating team. It was hilarious. But actually, I thought this video would only be a few minutes long, set at the TFC rules. It was pinfall and submission, and the actual match with this one is for grabbing the briefcase. But I'm going to let it keep going, because it's actually ridiculously entertaining, this match. Coming back to it. Uh, it's just as entertaining as the real match itself, to be honest. You don't expect that, to be honest, with AI versus AI on a match like type like this, because the AI doesn't know how to put on decent matches. They just like try and go for the ladder straight away, try and grab the belt. But these guys are going all at it in terms of its computer programming language. Maybe smaller is better. Who knows? But El, El Torito horns wobble there. Look at that. Oh, that oh, smelly, smelly. Oh, look at Most of that. El Torito going for the bookcase already. Very quickly on. Very quickly. No, he's not. Oh, he botched it. He botched it. But that was pretty much one of the spots. If you haven't seen it, spoilers for the next minute or so. If you've seen the triple team that El, um, the Matadors and El Torito do to one another, with this sort of sent on splash with the double back suplex. Oh my god, the kill switch! The kill switch off the top of the ladder. That's just. That's death. Uh, Hornswoggle's got it. Hornswoggle's got the briefcase. He's got it. Oh, he's too small to grab it. Tug it, tug it. Tug it. Just keep tugging. Keep tugging. Oh, God. Oh, God. He hurt his back. I had to hurt the back. Oh, somersault leg drop. Somersault leg drop. But they did that. That spot, El Torito was on the ladder. El Matador is or Primo and Epico. Just call them Primo and Epico. They were doing their spot on the apron. And they went through like three tables. Two, three tables on the outside from inside the ring. It was a brilliant spot. It was an easy dub moment, without a doubt. And, oh, a kick in the face. Kick in the guts. Guts and spin kick. Ooh. Oh, yes. Once Swagger going up. Feeling the power. El Torito trying to knock the ladder over. No, you're just dragging now. Not powerful enough kick. Oh, that one was though. Took him out for six on that. They're slow, methodical. They're thinking on their feet. And El Torito is thinking on his head now with that neck breaker. That flashback. On to the ladder. Gets knocked down. He saw it coming. Drop to hold into the ladder. Into the ladder. El Torito trying to go up. Back and forth now. Trying to trying to stop each other. There we go. Oh, onto the tail. It's probably a bad thing to have a tail in this type of matchup because Alan Swalker can grab it and use it as a tug of war mechanism. It's not a Texas Bull Rope match here. It's a Wee LC. Ooh. Surprisingly fun. Oh my god, El Torito going moves up. Off the second rope. Boom. That could do it. That could do it. No, he's not. He's not ending it there. Got a splash on his bomb with a Santon. Santon's bomb splash. And a crucifix driver. He's got to be. Come on. Go for the. He's just hurting Hans Wobble. There's no need for this. Oh, and a DDT. 
The DDT. I think he's got this. Spike the moment said the DDT always spells the end. But no, Hornswoggle gets up. He gets up and gets Oh through the ladder. Oh the ladder landed on his face. Oh El Torito calling for it. Drop kick in the face. Uh, another on the ladder again. It may only be head scissors, but they're head scissors that are painful. Probably another top rope. To the top. Oh, under the top of the ladder. That's not a top rope, that's top of the ladder. Oh my god, he's ha dangling. He's dangling all two feet in the air. Hornswoggle can't grab him, he's too small. Oh, he did it. How did he do it? Superhuman jumping feet there. But definitely check it out on YouTube, the pre-show match. Because it's not on the pay-per-view, it's on YouTube, it's on WWE Network as well, they have the pre-show. But I'm pretty sure they do the pre-shows on YouTube now, don't they? So watch it there. You're used to. I haven't checked since the network, mind you. Oh, he tried to go ladder move. Oh no, not enough of kill switch. Off the top! That, that was it. That's it. But Hornswoggle has second thoughts. He's going to go for his tadpole splash. No tadpole, leg drop. Completely no sold by El Torito. Complete and utterly no sold. This is a high octane action. Oh my goodness, a Frankenstein. Off the top again. This is the move that finished the match of the pre-show. To run it through a table, a mini table. And uh, now uh, Frankenstein. Oh, through the ladder once more on the leg. Decapitating one's leg. But Hotswoggle's had enough. Using the good leg. Using that good leg. And a knockout punch there, knockout punch style. It's gonna be enough. Gonna be enough. He's gonna go top rope and end this. He is the small show. He's turned away from 3MB to be the small show. El Torito, faster up, faster pace. Dodging the punches, dodging the punches, but no! Break of the eyes and the horns. Grabbing the bull by the horns and slamming him face first into the mat. Ooh. I think that'll do it, folks. What a high octane match. Is it gonna be enough? Hornswoggle grabbing it. One little tug. The little tug is all it needs. The sensitive touch. The littleness. The tininess touch. We could do loads of small jokes, but we're not going to. We're not going to go there. Like I said, WWE did too many of that already. Don't get me wrong, quite hilarious, but still. Too many. But no, watch the match, guys, and see what you think. Really good. Probably one of the best pre show matches in a long time. Can't beat some table and ladders and chairs action. Oh my. See you soon. Bye bye.